there guys, I'm Gabriel. And I'm Tony. And this is Gabe's Quittable Cuisine. Look, we got merch. Brought to you by Your Moose Studios. We have merch pre-order, $5 per mug. Go ahead and email us at uh, yourmove.studios at gmail.com. Alright guys, so today we decided, or I decided that we're going to do a little episode on uh, food. Uh, you ever, what kind of food, Gabe? Good food. So uh, we decided, I decided one day I was sitting in my, at home, minding my own business. Sitting at my home. What? Oh, he's actually putting fluid in there. I was sitting at the house and I was like, man, I'm hungry. So I go to the fridge and I'm looking for stuff to eat, you know, just like any other person. And I'm like, you know, I got bread and I got cheese. How about I make a grilled cheese? Start looking for butter. There was no butter. So. What kind of a person doesn't got butter in their house? <laughs> so, uh. I decided one day we started using mayo, and mayo works perfectly fine with grilled cheese. So, came to my mind the other day, what about other con uh, condiments? You know, like mayo, or not mayo, but like ketchup and mustard and stuff. So, uh, we decided, I decided, we're going to test that theory. Let's see what we can grill and turn out and will actually taste good. Now, you've already went ahead and grilled up some grilled cheese for us, right? Yes, and you can see it here. Oh, so, it's so what's, the, what's the first one we got? Uh, the first one um, is uh, uh, this one. I don't know. I don't know. I decided to bring it, you know, decided to do something. This is the, the ketchup grilled Woo! cheese. The ketchup grilled cheese. Now, explain to us how the process of this worked out for you. Lathered it up with ketchup, threw it on a grill. How, do, how did it grill? Uh, it, it's kind of like soggy in the middle, so I don't know what it's going to taste like. Um, I'm expecting something like grilled cheese and tomato soup mashed together. So. <laughs> it's stuck to the plate. <laughs> oh, it was stuck to Thank the plate. Thank you, ghost hand. Oh, that's better. Look at that. Cut that thing in half. I used to work at a pizza joint. I am fully Why are you cutting it like that? Because that's how you cut a sandwich. All right, well. I, I have guess... a license. I know what I'm doing. This, this is... is CDL, but I still know what I'm doing. This is Heinz ketchup. Put it in the comments down below how to get a sandwich. With, uh... Oh, my God. You know, <laughs> it smells like really bad ketchup. It smells like someone <laughs> burnt tomato soup. Uh, Here goes nothing. Um, it's so delicious. <laughs> it's actually not that bad. It's really, like, slimy though. Yeah, it tastes like ketchup and grilled cheese. It tastes like if you dip your grilled cheese in tomato soup. That's what I think. That's what I was trying to get at. So, you know what I just said? Tomato soup and grilled cheese. Cool, well. Yeah. Besides, it's slimy. <laughs> I mean, it smells horrible, but... Yeah, the, the taste, taste isn't too bad. The taste is um, all right. It's so like cough syrup. Overall, it did not grill. It didn't crust over like your normal grilled cheese. And it kind of... It didn't... Here you, you know, go, ghost hand. It didn't really taste too bad. All right, so... The next sandwich that we're, we got... Um, if you have ketchup, you gotta have mustard. So, um. Gotta cleanse the palate. Using my state of the art patented Your Moves Studios mug. So now here $5 is. $5 pre order at yourmove.studios at gmail.com. So here is the mustard. Um, you know, when I grilled this one, it was a little bit different. Like, it browned the yellow. So it literally looks like just stale mustard on a piece of bread. And you'll see it in, when you watch the video. Well, that's a good sign. That is a good sign. It does not stick to the plates. <laughs> let's, uh, let's cut it up. So this is the, uh, I don't know, the mustard, I don't know, mustard, no. I don't know. So it's, whoa. It doesn't smell bad. It smells like mustard.
Well, it's crustier than the ketchup. And it just tastes like if you take a grilled cheese and you dip it in mustard. It tastes like McDonald's. It does. I mean, just this mustard filled flat hamburger list. Tastes like McDonald's. Not an ad, but Definitely. not not a bash either. It's just Oh no, McDonald's is great if you're on a budget. I think I'm gonna finish this one. It's not too bad. Cleanse the palate. Thank you, Ghost Hand. Thank you. Alright, so the next one. Um it's one of those condiments that you know you you get at home you don't have ketchup or mustard but you've got maybe you wanted the salad but you didn't have the salad but you got the dressing so i grabbed the most common dressing that you can think of and i went ahead and grilled a sandwich hidden valley not, not an ad. ad not an ad for any of so, this this one for actually our grilled patented your move studios mugs this one grilled really well uh Sounds good. Some of them were a little bit more difficult to grill. This one tried to burn a little bit, so you gotta constantly be flipping it. As you can see in the video, if this one was on it. Yeah, well, it should be. This is the yeah. first one, right? Yeah. Yeah, it should be. So this one, you had to flip it a whole bunch, so it wouldn't burn. But it did grill, and it did crust over. So far, yeah, let's cut it up. Oh, I did too. Well, sniff test. It actually that smells, smells good. delicious. It smells like if someone took a uh, like garlic or garlic something. bread and made grilled cheese out of it. It smells delicious. Mm. We need to market this. We need to sell this. Let's open up a grilled cheese stand and just sell this. Trademarked. Trademarked. Ranch and uh, grilled cheese. This is really good. Totally an ad. I thought it was really good. I'm gonna make wow. that. Wow. I'm gonna make that when I get home. That's delicious. Thank you, Ghost Hand. Wow. That was like the best one yet. That was delicious. Mm. So you got one more, right? Yep, so this one is the special one. I decided to throw it out there, just something random. And I was thinking, you know, usually when you eat ranch, you either have it with a salad or you eat it with like hot wings, like buffalo wings. So I was thinking spicy. I looked in my fridge, and what do you know? I had rooster sauce. Also known or as sriracha sauce. Sriracha! So I grilled up a sandwich with sriracha sauce. Um, this sandwich thank also. You, thank you, Gus Hand. This sandwich also did the same thing. It grilled up really well. It doesn't um, stick, so that's a good sign. Oh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, let's cut it up and let's... Uh, it doesn't look like the cheese melted too well in this either, but... That's just processed cheese for you. So it does no feel... government cheese, that's for sure. It, it feels is. a little bit slimy. Not as bad as the ketchup. And it's got some spice to it. Yeah, I got it. The smell of it is not appetizing to me at all. Wash your hands after you eat this. I like it. I like the smell of it. If we get 100 likes on this video, I'll spike them with laxative. Oh my god. <laughs> so I can't even really, like, I can't taste... I just taste hot sauce. ...the sriracha at all. All I've got is spice and cheese. <laughs> Queso! I mean, it's not bad. If you like spicy things. No. I'm, I'm finished with that Oh, one. crap. I'm allergic. Oh, I'm joking. So. I'm going to finish this. It's not too bad. I'm going to finish mine then. Because I'm a champ. There you go, ghost champ. So. Out of the. The four sandwiches that we made. I think by far we can agree that the ranch was the best. Uh, I give the ranch four mugs. So if I wanna, you know, if I had to 
How would you rate these? The ranch definitely Sorry. four mugs. Four mugs. No, the mustard wasn't too bad. The mustard, it, it was good. Like I said, it reminded me of McDonald's, so I'd say about two and a half mugs. What about the rooster sauce? Three mugs easy. All right, so. And that gets, uh, the ketchup gets a trash can because it sucked. Yeah, bye-bye. So if you're ever at home and you decide that, you know, you don't have mayo or butter. Or really, you just want to experiment a little bit. You could try this stuff. And by far, ranch has the best. It tastes amazing. It's, you have to constantly keep flipping it, but hey, it's only an experiment. So, once again, we got merchandise, Your Move Studios, and uh, what? And remember, it's Your Move, Internet. Oh. There's nothing in that cup. This is empty.